Welcome back, everybody. You already know this your girl have been sent. I want to thank all my subscribers. I truly appreciate y'all. Okay, so this is going to be your blackout for the energies that's coming in in the next three days. Keep in mind this read is general and it may not resonate with no damn body. Don't forget to check the link out in the description box. I am on Patreon. Okay, so going on over there, check out them reads if you're interested. If not, it's all good. Now, let me tap right in because energy that's coming in, okay, in the next three days, it's like, okay, I feel like you're about to be put in a situation where you're going to have to make a decision, like, for real. It's either you're going to continue to deal with this shit or just go off into the world and you're going to have this motherfucker stalking you. It's like how you want to go about some shit because I feel like the situation is coming in in the next three days. You're about to get some type of call, some type of message, some type of apology. It's going to be something that you're going to be sitting, listening, or looking at and going to be thinking to yourself like, okay, this person is doing too much. It may be overwhelming. Like, it's just going to all hit you at once. You know what I'm saying? A whole bunch of emotions and shit that this person is trying to explain. Okay? Because this is all their feelings. This is all their feelings. And it's going to happen around a time where it's like, okay, you could be at work. This is you grounded and grinding you know um this is you just pretty much calm cool like unbothered by a lot of things you know what i'm saying you just more focused on practical shit and all of a sudden this shit change your like they may try to change your mood or like this is something that's going to come out of nowhere that's going to surprise you or shock you. It's going to change your vibe is what this is. Like, it's going to change your vibe. And it's going to put you in this place of like, okay, you're going to be feeling a certain type of way. Like, you're going to feel like this is too much. Like, this person is overdoing it. Like, you, you're going to feel like, okay, you're going to know whatever happened in this situation this person was in the wrong put it like that like no you i feel like it's not at fault of some shit that may have happened or whatever and it puts you in this situation where this person is coming in to speak their feelings or something like that like it ain't gonna be nothing that's gonna like like because this may ha like something may have happened today or it's gonna happen tomorrow you know what i'm saying and it's like you may think like oh okay whatever here we go i ain't got time for it, whatever but then like a message is gonna come in quicker than you think is what i'm getting quicker than you think because see you just started a cycle with this person you just started a, a new cycle and you was not supposed to be at the end of the cycle right now. Like you just started it. So how the fuck you jump from, okay, cool to not cool. Like what, what, what happened? Like what's really going on? You know what I'm saying? Let's go behind the motherfucking membrane of some shit. Okay. Cause this shit not making sense. And I feel like this person knows that shit because it's like, okay, why you coming back around anyway? Like, what? Well, why? Why? Because somebody, this person may feel bad about how shit played out or 
how this person is thinking or how you know what i'm saying this is like delusional energy all type of shit mixed in with this type of shit okay because ain't no way like i feel like you and this person could have been working hard on something like y'all was working on something this was like you know starting over you in a new cycle with this person then and then all of a sudden or whatever the fuck happened this shit is is clearly you at the end of, of a cycle like you finna wrap up a cycle that like you just started like this is stupid <laughs> is what this is because it's all coming from this person coming back that's where all this is coming from because it's like everything is blocked like the doors are closed that's why this person is coming back ain't like huh the doors are closed you was in a new cycle with this person this is like okay you supposed to be working on something change communication like all the good shit or whatever is going on and it's like you feel like you in a like you finishing up a cycle and it's like no you supposed to be no like that's why this person is coming back around so quick because it's like y'all two not supposed to be at the end of a cycle dealing with this shit <laughs> what already is what i'm getting so now you have to decide <laughs> like it's all in your hands at this point because i feel like See, this person is going to let off all these emotions on you. They're going to overdo it. They're going to fucking overdo it. And it's like, okay, what you want to do? You want to give this person another chance? Or you just want to go off into the world and just see what's out there? You know what I'm saying? Because whatever this is, it's like, at this point, it got to be something better than this shit. Like, for real. That's how you feel right now. Like, come on. But I feel like this person is going to open up to you. Like, it's like, it's going to be so fucking overwhelming, y'all. You're going to be like, what the fuck is going on? You're going to be like, what the fuck is going on? Because, see, it's all, see, this is what it is. See, the foundation, it's a good foundation of, like, happiness and joy, but it could have been just one of them days, you know, where it was like a storm, okay? Like, all right, the sun ain't shining today. Like, it's a motherfucking storm, rain around this bitch, thundering, shit, but, you know, the sun shines, you know, it comes back out or whatever. That's what the foundation is. Like, in reality of what makes a motherfucker happy, what makes a motherfucker fulfilled, you know, it was just one of them days. It was just a bad day. Motherfuckers, motherfuckers was having a bad day. And I feel like this person got it all in their feelings, emotionally, felt a certain type of way. Just, a, I don't know. I don't know. Because it's like, your energy is like, okay... <laughs> you kind of mature in this situation right now you kind of mature because i feel like your strength is even though whatever the fuck is going on you still focus on yourself you still put in whatever you was like okay oh okay we're not talking well okay i'm gonna put all this energy into myself like i'm not fin to we're not gonna do this we not fin to feel sorry we not finna be sad we not finna that's what we not finna do here it's like i guess I take it as a loss i'm not finna cry about it because i feel like you've been here before you may have just finished a cycle with this person dealing with this type of shit and it's like okay what the fuck is we in mercury retrograde like what the fuck is going on like is this shit coming back around like what, what is this like that's how you feel right now because it's like at this point right now dealing with it today today you are not supposed to be in this energy of like it's over <laughs> no i feel like you're looking at the situation like you know i guess we're just two different people we two different people 
I feel like you could be the type that triggers this person. You know what I'm saying? Like this person, see, you be ready to, you be ready to solve the issue right then and there and shit like that. You ready to talk about what the fuck is going on. This person is just ready to sit and, 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 and time go bad. And that's how they fucking lose. Waiting. They waiting and you keeping it moving. You know what I'm saying? It's like, okay, I ain't got, I ain't got time to fucking wait. It's like, what are, what are we waiting on? What are we waiting on? We had a conversation right now. So this is leading to, I feel like this person going to be talking to themselves. Like you may lis- listen, but you're not going to reciprocate it. Like you're not going to fill in the blanks. You're not going, okay, well, I feel like this and this and this and that. It's like, okay, you know what? You can have the floor. Say whatever you need to say to get off your fucking chest. Because obviously this person is going to be, this person is triggered in a way, mad in a way, but they're afraid in a way. And I guess they need to balance their mind out by just talking and talking and talking. And it's like, okay, I'll listen, but I ain't saying shit. You're not going to say shit. And then you're going to figure out all this shit that this person is saying. You're going to find out that this person is codependent on you. And it's not going to work. For real. Like, you're going to find out that this person is codependent. And it's not working. It's not working. Like, I don't know what's going on in their brain where it's like they depending on you for something here. This is some mental ass shit that motherfuckers need to heal. Like, something's going on with their brain, y'all. Like, this is some mental ass shit. Like, this shit right here, you can't fix. This, they can't blame this shit on you. This is something that they have to fucking work on. Like, they really need to focus on some shit. They really need to, like, really tap in and really go deep and maybe need to talk to somebody about how they thought processes, process is or, or it's something. It's something. Like, this shit is out of, out of your fucking hands. You know what I'm saying? Like, on some real shit. So I feel like this is leading to them talking to themselves. Yeah, you're going to listen. Yeah, you're going to read every text. Yeah, but it's like they're going to vent. They're going to say this shit. But it's like it ain't really nothing left for you to say. What do they want you to say? What do they want you to say? (sighs) This is so fucking toxic. It's toxic and it's tiring. Like on some real shit. It's toxic and tiring and it, it's just It's like things is is see, they're gonna notice. They're gonna notice like this type of behavior, like this type of shit, like whatever happened or whatever's going like this type of shit, motherfuckers ain't fucking with this shit. Cause this is this is like shit going left shit not moving you know what i'm saying like they're gonna fuck around and lose you type shit because it's it's just like at the end of the day motherfuckers ain't fucking with that with these mental issues motherfuckers ain't, ain't built for this type of shit you know what i'm saying when well, motherfuckers has mental problems or it's like delusional and making up shit or just it's it's just too fucking much you know what i'm saying it's too much because your energy is just grounded calm like let's solve the issue right then and there let's you know what i'm saying focus on real shit it was a bad day okay get over it no motherfuckers is trying to hold on to shit trying to like it's just too fucking much it's too fucking much okay this is too fucking much like all these this is motherfuckers is tired of arguing it and these issues and being mad and just mind games and all of this shit don't nobody want to put up with this shit Don't nobody want to put up with this shit. Because in a minute, if motherfuckers keep 
you know what I'm saying? Keep, 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 keep on, motherfucker. That type of mentality. It's like, okay, motherfuckers gonna really be turning into shit where it's like, okay, motherfuckers gonna be using their words and this is gonna be creating men. We gonna start manifesting some, some, some fucked up shit dealing with this shit. Okay, like motherfuckers don't wanna stoop to that type of level where it's like, look, this shit right here got to end, got to stop. Cause you don't want a motherfucker that's an enemy where you playing the blame game and all this pointing a finger and all of this and this and this and that and you want to be the victim all the motherfucking time. It's like, okay, since you want to be the victim all the fucking time, you finna be in in, in every situation, you are gonna be the victim. Everything is gonna go always wrong for you. You know what I'm saying? Like, motherfuckers better stop fucking playing with motherfuckers out here. Like, look. Motherfuckers ain't known that shit, though. They don't want them type of problems. They don't want them type of problems because it's like, okay, you keep acting, keep playing, keep acting like you the victim. We are gonna look, trust. You can get put in a situation where you always the victim on real time. You know what I'm saying? It's like, nah, we ain't, we don't want that, them problems now. <laughs> like, leave, leave motherfuckers alone. Look, motherfuckers need to go take a motherfucking aspirin or something because some ain't working. Okay, some ain't working because right now you motherfuckers ain't even supposed to be going through this type of shit. Like for real. They not not it's too early in the cycle. It's too early. It's too early. You know what I'm saying? Like, ain't what 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 the fuck? This is This is first quarter. What the fuck? This ain't even halftime. Motherfuckers ain't even made it to halftime yet. What the fuck is going on? So yeah. That's pretty much all I got. Hopefully that shit just made sense. And um, yeah. Thumbs the fuck up. And I'll see y'all on the next one. Peace out, y'all.